to glory, Javi. We are proud to serve you, Javi. Wet my lips with another horn of mean, brother. Drink for strength. Eivor, Tyr said you would come. Welcome. Are you... Are you Valka's mother? Swala? You have a keen eye, Wolfkist. After all this time, Eivor, we have arrived. Now raise a horn with Freya here and sing a victory song. Sigurd, what is all this? Your, your arm has returned, and your vigor as well. Glory eternal, Eivor. Here we dine in the great hall of the slain, at long last. Oh, I want to scream with joy. This is... this is all so beautiful. Your visions were... they were real. The battle has closed! Come, dear! To the field! Fight with us! Go, Eivor. Enjoy the fight. You have earned your place here. This is incredible! Enough with those short flies! You and I must fight! The battle we never had! And hold nothing back, for here we need not fear a thing! Spill the eternal blood of Valhalla! At last, I share the dead of the infinite battle with a true. Brother! Worry not, Eivor! <laughs> For we earn no scars here, only battle wisdom. What just happened? Sigurd, your arm has grown back. It was never gone, Eivor. Not truly. Nothing is permanent here. I told you. Nothing save the courage and reputation of its warriors. Are we immortal in this place? <laughs> Let us discover that together. A new day.
bit to the marrow's bed. Again, you've lost your arm. And again, it will. Be Father, is that you? That cannot have been my father. The Harvey returns to lead us to victory. Skull! Skull! Take your horn. Join the battle cheer. Dearest Skull, the war and verse. How do you like this frenzy so far? It is... It is quite something. Raise your horn, Eivor. What stops you? My father, Varin. Have you seen him in this hall? I have not. Should he be here? No, he died a coward. Yet by Odin's eye, I swear I've seen him. Cast aside your cares in Valhalla. Let Seeking go. We have earned our joy. The journey is complete. The I saw you, Father. Where are you? Show yourself. Lead us to glory, Javi. We are proud to serve you, Javi! Great warriors! Have you seen Varin? Who? Varin. My father. Varin! Father! This fucking arm, I'll beat a man to death with it. Do you not tire of his injuries? Never. Wait. Father? Eivor, you have a guest. You should have knocked first. Nonsense! I brought you someone. Look! My Eivor! There you are! What a warrior you have made of yourself! I am overfilled with pride. How did you find your way here? You remember our great battle? You remember how we fought, side by side, with your mother and Sigurd and our clans united? We fought, father, but you did not. You died a coward. Eivor, enjoy this. Your father has returned. <laughs> Have you lost all your love for life? That was not my father. That was a lie. That was not a lie. That was my gift to you. I have power here. And I can do as I please. 
You wished to see your father. I made it happen. As easy as breathing. By Odin's laws, my father is not allowed in this place. I do not wish to see him where he should not be. Your father died doing what he hoped would save you. He died to protect you. And his clan. No. He... This is the end of our road, Eivor. This is Valhalla. The eternal golden field. Now come. Battle beckons! How is all this possible? How were the slain brought here? The Valkyries know this. Only them. No. That cannot be true. None of this feels right. Do not despair, Eivor. Look. Your friends are here. Everyone you could ever want is here beside you. No. They are not real. This place is a lie. This place can be whatever you wish it to be, Eivor. I do not want it. Not like this. You would resign yourself to an empty death? The ecstasy I feel here is an illusion. I would sooner call like a raven than sing a false song. Illusion or not, here there is no death, no pain, no loss, no betrayal, not like out there. You want this? To live inside a lie? I am an old woman with a broken body. What life I had left was brief, so I bid farewell. ...to my dear Volka... ...and came here. I wish you well, Swala... ...but this is not for me. I must find Sigurd. the fucking arm! Sigurd, this is an illusion. A trick. Leave with me now, and return to England with me. Our people need us. No. I am no one in that world. I am somebody here. Powerful. Capable. A god. Here I may live forever. Here I cannot die. Cows die. Family die. You must die. The only thing that never dies is the reputation of the one who's died. In here, you have no reputation. But out there, it's not too late. 
Every day the same empty war, the same hollow victory, spilling blood that tastes of water and smells of grass. You have known real battle, real glory, but this is not it. You know this. I know you do. Brother, it is time to leave. Am I destined to follow you everywhere? Till the end of my life? All right. We go. No, you stay. I do not give you leave to go. Why leave this place? A glory you fought so hard to find. Walk with me. I am humbled to walk with you, Eivor. Your reputation is a song warriors will sing forever. You are the wolf-kissed one, who lingered at the edge of death, yet fought back. You spilled the raven wine of battle, to paint whole kingdoms red. You have killed kings and crowned them as you desired, bowing to none. You stood tall where your brother stumbled, yet still you came to his aid. Many great foes in your brief time. You have earned your place here, Eivor. Seize it. Stand aside. My people need me. I have given you everything you wanted. Everything you needed. You gave me nothing. It was all me. Yet I cleared your path. I guided your axe. You were a fly, buzzing in my ear. How dare you deny me? Everything you believe in stirs before you. Yet you question all. You question the very gods. Ah, fight me! Do not diminish yourself! Your cause hall is nothing but a dream. Yeah, nothing but a dream. A dream is as real as anything in this world. Do dreams not inspire? Do dreams not make us feel? Do they not push men to their greatest glories? Then I'm done with dreaming. Yeah.
Eivor, stand. Why? Why do you flee from the truth? upon my command. Take... Take off your axe! Leave me now! You will 
nothing. With me, with wisdom, glory, power, what more do you need? Everything else. Sigurd, are you? Are you with me? Sigurd! Ah, the Hanged One awakes. Feet upon the ground once more. Eivor, be careful! Vasim, what is this? Come closer, Eivor. Let me get a better look at you. Leave him be, Vasim. For too long I stared at the sun. It blinded me to the truth. That it was you. It was you I wanted all along. Did you track us here? Like a cowardly fox concealed in the brush? You widowed my destiny, Wolfkist. You broke all my hopes. He's mad, Eivor. Silence him! Come, Eivor! Come save your crippled prince of dead races. Are you hurt? It is nothing. Go, kill that background. You must suffer a thousand times what I suffered. What is this about? My son, Eivor. This is about my son. You speak nonsense, Basim. Forgiveness is impossible. We shared so much in England. Fought and bled together. Dig, Eivor, into the wellspring of your memory. I do not wish to fight with you. What does battle serve? Let us speak. I have waited countless ages for this moment. No more talk. I hunger for this kill. <laughs> Show me your neck. Show me. <laughs> the 
kiss of a wolf takes my prize! Of course! Yeah! Rise! My son will not have suffered in vain! You stop nonsense! Like an alehouse drunk! If you are resigned to this, so be it! You will never see your home or your people again. When I am finished, you will be a sack of blood and shattered bones, and my conditions will be clear. Make this more interesting. We'll drag Sigurd into the fray. Coward! Face me! Fight me here! Sigurd, be careful! He's coming for you! Oathbreaker, you die here! This brings me no joy, Justice Bringer. You were always so kind, but you chose the wrong side. Your prize, Basim. Come. You are indeed. Does he still live? 
It does. But in darkness. Good. Bastard. For how long had Basson been planning this treachery? I dare not guess. Gods! Am I to be hounded by a parade of blood-minded traitors the whole of my life? There is no end to this. You have something you want to say? Then say it. I... Uh, I need some time to breathe. Let me sit a moment. That man's anger... His rage... It had a familiar sting that I... I cannot place. He was raving, Sigurd. Without sense or reason. Paid no mind. I am not mad, Eivor. These things I see and feel, I know they are true. I know, brother. Now more than ever, you always spoke true. We should cast our eyes towards home. It is a long journey and I am... not well. Home. Eivor, on our journey here, I had much time to think. On the ecstasies and the agonies of our friendship. I am not the man I was. My time as the Jarl of our clan has run short. You must lead us now. Do you mean this? Randvi told me of your bravery. Your courage. Your wisdom. In my absence, you were a pillar of stone. She admires you. And I her. But that cannot be the only reason. When Dar called you out and challenged you to a duel, you let him die with honor, in spite of his betrayal. He did what he felt was right, and I honored that. I recall our days in Oxenifortshire, our search for the Sacker Stone. You disagreed with my orders. But you followed them. You questioned my methods, my aims. But you did not disobey. And when I passed judgment on Holger, you let my sentence lie. Though I knew you disagreed, the look on your face said all. And I remember and admire the way you guided us from Norway to England. You kept my anger in check, my ambitions focused. It was a trying time. In all my days away, in my fog of confusion, you have shown great wisdom and strength and leadership. Where you go, Eivor, I will follow. Our clan is yours to lead. Thank you, brother. I... I won't let you down. You have a stormy look. Years ago, before we left for England, I saw a vision. A vision that foretold a betrayal. That I would betray you. I refused to believe it. I would never do such a thing, I told myself. But in the years since, I have robbed you of your dreams. Of England, of Valhalla. If you feel I have wronged you, brother, I will make it right. We cannot unweave our fates, Eivor. All is laid before us, from the day we are born. To be angry at this would be like... Like wrestling the ocean. A pointless struggle. We two ragged ravens. What a saga we have inscribed together. A tale for the ages.